Frederick is back! Yay! <laughs> Finally, darling! And we are still thinking... Oh, we are still thinking <laughs> what I'm going to do. We are going to do something modern. Yeah. yeah. Probably silver. The idea was silver and blue, but I'm sure we're gonna end with pink and red. <laughs> <laughs> so let's start this Christmas. I'm trying to get him naked, but he won't. <laughs> I'm joking. I just told him, just finished shaving, and I'm, I will start the, I mean, covering his eyebrows and everything, plugging his eyebrows, I think that's what they say, plugging, plugging. And I start touching it, and I feel a lot of oil here. And I said, What did you do? Moisturizing. Moisture. Moisture. Moisturizing. Yeah, I put it all over. When I shave, I just like use a uh, refractor. But I'm like, okay. Uh, but it's really good and it repairs everything, but I just use it all over because I. Yeah, like it's alright to do that, to take up of your skin. But the thing is, when you're gonna use glue and all that jazz, you cannot have oil on, on, on the hair because now the glue won't work. So I don't know what I'm gonna do to take off this oil. So please, if you wanna do drag, never use oil stuff on your brows. I'm covering his eyebrows now, and as you can see, I need glasses yet. I need glasses. Oh my god, I am destroying his face. I really don't have any idea what I'm gonna do. But let's see. Uh, what I did was I'm using the Crayolan, very very white Crayolan, and I'm doing this kind of cat eye. I want to do a very thick eyeliner, black eyeliner, but I want to follow all this structure of the cat eye. Let's hope for better. Now I'm covering his face with this light foundation, and he's like a Japanese doll now. A Japanese doll. I want to really to keep the white on the top of the eyes because I want to blend a lot of colors. Pray for me, my darlings. So till now, his own foundation everywhere. The white, you see, it's less strong. And now let's start the powder. Powder, lots of powder. So what I'm doing is I'm using the creamy makeup. Pure 304, it's a blue one by Grimask, and I'm creating this cat eye in blue. Next, I'm gonna follow the black and everything, but just to give me the way to build the makeup. So I started from the inner corner and I go up. It's just the pure product, the only product, and after you blend a little bit. Just creating a cut crease. I don't know where I'm gonna get with this cut crease, but I'm creating it anyway. So what I did, I created a cut crease with the same product, the um, uh, creamy makeup, and now I'm going to blend. This is only the creamy makeup. I'm not using um, eyeshadow or anything, and I'm just blending with the 217 by Mac. This gorgeous product, this gorgeous brush, and I'm gonna bring all the blue. And next, I'm gonna add some uh, eyeshadow, blue eyeshadow, like two, three shades of blue. All right. So far, so I use as a base the uh, blue cream makeup by Grimace, and I did all the cat, all the structure of the eyes. And after, I use three kinds of blue. Wait. From this fabulous palette from Crayolan that I love, and I used you know dark blue, light blue, and I used a lot of white on the nose and also here. We don't know. We're not sure if we're going to use black, but till now that's that's what we created so far. We are trying to make a pink nose. It's not easy. But now we're gonna use a lot of white under the eyes, following here. And after we play, we're gonna play with lots of pink, all kinds of pink. And let's see what's going to happen. Let's explain. He wanted something like pink under the eyes. 
So he was trying to explain uh, where he saw the image was a David Bowie movie. Yeah, David Bowie. So we had a look there and uh, we found out there was a picture with a lot of paint and everything. So he started creating a kind of shadow under the eye. Um, and I asked him if it was okay, he said I want more pink. So I used my creamy makeup, my grimace again, but this is in pink. And I created a line here going up, and now I'm gonna blend with shadow blush or pink stuff. And let's see. My Lumiere powder, Luxe powder by Ben I, because he wants something, you know, he wants to shine a little bit. And I said, Jeffree Star. <laughs> Jeffree Star. No, this is Jeffree Star. Look. Lots of shimmering things like that. So this is great. Look. Suddenly we brought a lot of light. Can you see it? I don't know if you can see it. And after it created the contouring with silver. It's an old eyeshadow I have by Grimace. The, it becomes a little bit of grey, blue. Um, and I used a piece of paper to make it really sharp. And now we are deciding about the lips. Maybe yellow we said, huh? Yeah. Let's try it then. So we did it. Oh my god, we did it. Well, it was more or less what we thought we were going to do. A lot of colors. And uh, it's the, the first attempt. We are trying to create something different. It's nice, isn't it? If you wanted something like Japanese, you know, uh, something really crazy based in a lot of stuff he likes. So, are you happy with that? Yeah, I'm super happy. Look at me, I'm a star. <laughs> 33,000 people watch me now. <laughs> It's good, I like it, I like it. So I hope you did like it. If you did, don't forget to thumb it up, to share the video and all that jazz and subscribe for more nice videos. And if you want Frederick back, just write it down, alright? As a blooper, I'm gonna show you what I decided to do in the end of the makeup. Sometimes when you finish your makeup before taking it off, it's a good opportunity to, you know, uh, get your technique more precise because you know you're going to destroy the makeup so you can do whatever you want. So what we did here, I had more black, I double three, three times, four times false eyelashes and white under and I think it changed the makeup, huh? It's more dramatic. <laughs> I always like to do this when I finish my makeup. I change a little bit just to see what, what happens. so many weeks and we are really having fun I like it me too I feel like a dragon <laughs> you, should, you should run for a RuPaul's Drag Race yeah. right now well you know what I'm ready there yeah. me I'm first mm -hmm. if you follow me on YouTube I think you Heard you've heard about his experience with Mimi on first. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>